You know I love cute finger foods, so I'm making my hot dog flour buns, which are the prettiest, fluffiest pigs and blankets in all the land. So to get started on my dough, I'm gonna add two and three quarters of a cup of bread flour to my mixer bowl, and next a quarter cup of sugar, two and a quarter teaspoons of instant yeast will help get these guys fluffy, two teaspoons of kosher salt, and now because hot dogs go so well with mustard, I'll enhance the dough with two teaspoons of mustard powder. I'll whisk to combine, that's it for my dry ingredients. Growing up in Chicago, whenever we would go out to dim sum in Chinatown, we'd go across the street to the Chinese bakery and they would have these huge fluffy ready buns with hot dogs in the center and they were my favorite. I still crave them. So that's what these are inspired by, but today I'm making them into a flower shape. I love them. My dry ingredients are combined. I'll crack an egg into three quarters of a cup of water. Add my second mustard, yellow. I'll whisk this up. Add it to the dry ingredients. And knead on low until it forms a ball. Then I'll add in a quarter cup of coconut oil a little at a time to make it extra rich. All right, this dough is looking really nice and smooth. Get it off the mixer and then grab a clean bowl. I'm gonna drizzle this with a little bit of oil so the dough doesn't stick. I'll gather the dough into a ball, and that's just gonna ensure that it rises evenly. I'll smush it around in the bowl, turn it over. I'm gonna cover this and let it rise until it's doubled in size, about one to two hours. My dough is puffy, I've got my dogs, and now I'm ready to shape my flowers. So to do that, I'll turn the dough out onto my counter and I'll work with half of the dough at a time, and I'll divide this into six pieces for six hot dogs. I'll roll this piece of dough into a snake. I'll grab a hot dog, and starting at one end, I'm gonna wrap the snake of dough around it very tightly, leaving a little of the ends exposed. See, now it has a puffy coat. I'll roll it back and forth a few times to smooth it out, and now I'll cut it into six equal slices. And then on my baking sheet here, I've lined it with parchment so that they don't stick. I'll place one hot dog slice down and that'll be the center. And then I'll surround with the remaining hot dog slices. I'll shake the rest now and then they'll proof for 30 minutes until they're puffy. My buns have proofed beautifully. They just need an egg wash. Bernie has a hot dog dance. It goes. Do the hot dog dance. Do the do do hot dog dance. That's her move. And I'll finish with my third mustard seeds. And now I'll just bake these at 375 degrees for about 25 minutes until they're golden. It smells like hot dogs in here. Let me check out my buns. Oh, baby. Those look awesome. I'll let these cool briefly. Well, I get my fourth and final mustard. Mmm. I've got Chinese hot mustard, which is gonna clear my sinuses right out. I'll get these onto my platter. Oh no, this one's not gonna fit. I better destroy the evidence immediately. Mm. This is bringing me right back to my childhood. Holy hot dogs, these are fantastic. <laughs> 